Good morning, I'm Brooke Hayes. People here in Wisconsin say the mass shootings that happened over the weekend should never have happened. Those shootings happened in El Paso, Texas and Dayton, Ohio. At Mile of Music in Appleton, several musicians say it was horrifying. The event, which features artists performing in downtown Appleton, had security guards present on every corner. 85 jobs are leaving Green Bay. A notice from Schneider says the layoffs make up 3% of their Green Bay workforce. The layoffs affect four local locations. The layoffs are expected to be effective September 30th. And Packers practice will have a little extra energy this week as the Green and Gold welcome in Wisconsin native J.J. Watt and the Houston Texans for two joint practices. The practices will begin at 10.15 a.m. today and tomorrow, and they are open to the public. I'm meteorologist Michael Fish, and it's going to be warm and muggy today. Then we're going to have to watch the first of our scattered storms developing this afternoon and maybe becoming a bit more widespread going through the evening as well. But it's not going to last all night. They're actually going to move on out. But with any of those, you could see some gusty wind or possibly a little bit of hail, that not being ruled out. But otherwise, before they get here, 86 degrees, going to be humid. These scattered thunderstorms developing out there, the wind picking up. And they become a bit more widespread, especially later this afternoon into the evening. But those gradually end. Again, some gusty wind is possible with these. And then for tomorrow, 84, mostly sunny. Still going to be humid out there. And even warmer and more humid again on Wednesday, but a cool front getting close. That going to be Wednesday afternoon and evening with a chance of showers and storms. But for the Packers preseason game, actually going to finally cool it down to 77. Now you can download that news app. You just search for WGBA in your app store. It's totally free.